Hey guys, welcome back. Today, I'll be showcasing Hello Reaper in a Universal Time on Roblox. Let's get straight into it. Before we start, something to note is that Hello Reaper and Reaper have the same moves, same abilities, same passives. It's just that Hello Reaper is rarer because you need to use an extra item on it. Alright, so let's start with the passives. The only passive that Reaper has is that it gains souls every time it kills someone. It starts off at 666 health and then ends up at what I am now, 1300 health. And once you get to 1300 health, you have insane speed and damage. I mean, just look how fast I am crossing the map. I mean, seriously. It's like I can do it in one jump. Oh, I can do it in one jump. All right, so every soul Reaper gets, uh, the health gains six points, and you gain some speed, and you also gain some damage and whenever you kill someone you also get health back so if you're not at full health then you kill someone you'll get I don't know maybe a hundred or something now on to the attacks the first attack for Reaper is the triple you go up to an enemy in this case it's the menacing training dummy and on the keyboard you press the E key the letter E and that happens and it also bleeds oh well makes the opponent bleed the next ability is scythe lunge go up to your opponent press the R key on the keyboard and you do immense damage I mean just look at this go up to anyone with scythe lunge like this person right here, instantly dead. All right, on to the next move. The next move is throw or scythe throw. You aim where you want your scythe to go and it's got a short range and you control it with shift lock or with zooming in. So you press the T key on the keyboard and you throw your scythe out a pretty good distance I mean it would be pretty good for when you have low souls and trying to reach out if someone's running away just like so the next ability is slash when you press the F key you head forward in the way you're facing and you well slash as you can see well I missed the dummy right there so we'll have to wait until the cooldown finishes then I can do it again it does quite a bit oh this dummy's not working oh it might be working now yep 735 damage each slash now that's quite a bit at max souls the next ability is slam when you press the H key on the keyboard oh no there we go that's what happens. You slam the ground and spikes appear doing a ton of damage. But you get no souls for killing anyone with the slam move. So I wouldn't use it unless you're like desperate in a fight or have max souls already. And it's also great for starting out. So if you ever just want to kill someone, you just use slam and it basically insta kills them. So the last ability that Hello Reaper has is this. It is called Counter. So you hold down the Q key and you stick up your scythe. And whenever someone hits you, you teleport behind them. Nice. Let's do it again. Let's see. They do it, and I teleport. 
And the good thing about that is that you don't take any damage from the attack when they hit you. Good. See? You just teleport behind them so you can go ready for a counter attack. Oh, and this is how fast and how much damage and how much health it has when you don't have all of the salts. The next ability is the dash. You face your character somewhere, then you press the Z key and you dash forward. The last ability is dodge. You face your character somewhere and you press the C key and you roll. It's much faster when you have more souls. Something else you can do with Reaper is that you can change the blade's color. To change the blade's color, you change your torso's color in the avatar on the Roblox website. So as you can see, his torso is blue, so his scythe is blue. I changed mine to red, uh, purple, not red, but you can't see it because um, I have clothing on. So if you have clothing on, it doesn't really matter what color your torso is, and it will change the color of your scythe. And also changes the color of your slam spikes too, as you can see. Another thing is that when you slam onto a sands, which is this stand or spec right here, as soon as you use the slam, it takes away all their stamina, so you can kill them, as you can see. There, whereas usually they would have dodged. If you enjoyed, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get notified when I make a new video. Thanks for watching, and see you all next time.